Okay, so for everybody hopping on, I just want to let you know, hello, hello, how are you today? I just want to let you know, this is like the most random purse sale I'm having yet. It is, <laughs> it's a mess, you guys. Hi, everybody. Welcome to today's purse sale. Um, yeah, it's going to be something else because I just have stuff piled everywhere. Yesterday, Randy and I spent the entire day um, sourcing purses. So me and my little buddy here are going to go ahead and get on it because I think I probably thrifted at least three cows yesterday. I have a lot of leather here for you guys today. <laughs> How are you everybody? How's everybody doing today? My apologies for this hot mess up in here. Hello. You want to say hello? Come here. Come here. No? You don't want to see mommy? You're just going to lay there? Huh? You're just going to lay there? Okay. She's not ready yet. She's it's still a little early for her. Oh, my gosh. Okay, you guys. So I'm going to get the details out first for everybody that's just coming on. Um, if you're new, my name is Kim. I thrift handbags, wallets, designer, all sorts of different brand names um, from very high end to mid range to no name. Um, all of my items are for sale here. And as soon as the video loads after my live, all of the prices and how to pay will be listed down below in the description box. All sales are final. Do not purchase. If you have any type of wondering if it's, you know, any type of not sure in your mind, do not purchase because all sales are final and I only ship within the U.S. The dentist was absolutely horrible. You guys, wait till I tell you. Wait till I tell you. The dentist trip was horrible. <laughs> and I will go ahead and let you all in all on that. Um. So yeah, just wanted to get the purse details out of the way. U.S. shipping only, I sh and I only accept PayPal. Okay, so I have a message of the day for you guys, and that message is do not neglect yourselves. Do not neglect yourselves. I have neglected my mouth for way, way, way too long, and now I have to get oral surgery. I have to get bridges. I have to get new crowns because I have a one of my tooth, one of the one of my um, upper teeth here has, believe this or not, it has a crown on it, and it has a fractured root. Okay, the root is split completely in half. This tooth down here, there's not even I, they can't even save it. I have to get they have to pull this one, and I have to get a bridge made. Um. Anyways. $9,000 later, due to complete neglect, not meaning, I mean, I brush and I floss every single day, but I do have some, <clears throat> um, let's just say, let's say, I have some physical ailments that I don't talk about here that has caused my mouth to deteriorate extremely quickly. And I'm so busy taking care of everybody else, making sure, you know, of course, I'm a mom, taking care of Reed's teeth and Randall's medical issues and you know everybody else that I just I'll be fine. I'll be fine I don't need to take care of me right now. Well, I do and um, thousands and thousands and thousands of dollars later Starting I go in for my oral surgery on May 5th. It's a beautiful thing <sighs> So yeah That is how my dentist appointment went. I should get my receipt out and let you guys know it's like a I was like, are you kidding me? I look the figure of health, right? I look healthy. My teeth look fine. Other than a little, you know, crooked, whatever. I had braces and shit happens, whatever. But no, just because stuff looks good, take care of yourselves. Go to the dentist on a regular. Get your regular checkup. And a matter of fact, because of that, I've had a little spot on my face here that I'm like, eh, it'll go away, whatever. I think I have a skin cancer on my face. So I also made an appointment for that. 
<laughs> and I go in next Friday, I think, to make sure. And they're probably going to have to do what they did to my chest and cut that out too and whatever. But you know what? Take care of yourselves on a regular or something that could be very small and fixable will turn into a hot, gigantic mess that I have right now as well. So that's just my... My word of the day, do not neglect yourselves no matter how much you're taking care of everybody else. Oh, and also, you guys, also, I love my diet soda, okay? Most people like their sugar soda, their diet soda, whatever. I found out from my dentist that all soda, diet, anything with carbonation in it is poison. Not only poison to your teeth, but poison to your innards. So he told me, and he tells everybody, quit drinking soda. It just eats away at your enamel. I mean, there's just a million things he told me. I was in that appointment, you guys, for about an hour and a half for my checkup. Yeah. So I'm not happy. I'm not happy at all, especially taking my college funds for my son that I have savings and spending it on my mouth. Okay. But... I don't want to be that person that has to have false teeth throughout their mouth. And if I keep going that way, then that's what's going to happen. So here comes the purse sales. I'm going to be selling my booty off like crazy so I can replenish my savings for my son's college education because I'm spending a huge chunk of it on my stinking mouth. How about that? That's how my dentist appointment went. That's because I've neglected going to the dentist every six months. Yeah. 10000 almost $10,000 later. Mm -hmm. That's my share. That's my share, you guys. Okay? Almost 10000 It's like, um, no, actually almost 9000 It's like 8700 something like that. That's my share. <sighs> I'm going to need candles burned for me. I'm going <laughs> to I, you know, I think I was more scared of going and finding out rather than just, you know, going in and and um, getting the stuff done. It's, bleh, I can't, ugh, yeah. I had really super bad dental care when I was younger. I went all the time, but trauma, major dental trauma, because, you know, back then in the 70s, dentists were buttholes. Yeah. Well, Jenny, uh... I'm even having to get a special uh, cleaning done where they're going to numb all my gums and do a special cleaning and all of that stuff. Thank you. See, that's what I'm talking about. I may look lovely on the outside, but the inside is just rotten away. So never judge a, never judge a book by its cover because I'm a hot mess. Ooh. That's right. Even Buggy knows. Even, I'm a hot mess, right? Cheers to going to the dentist. Go get your regular checkups and all that. Now, enough of, sorry, I just dripped coffee. <laughs> okay. Um, oh, thank you. Thank you very much. This is, this is me in a picture right here, riding a horse, holding a surfboard. Couldn't explain me even more. It couldn't explain me even, couldn't explain me more better. You guys ready? Are you ready for a purse sale today? Uh, I am. I, I I gotta fill that bank account up because Home Slice has got some serious cha ching going out. Starting, you know, my oral surgery is May fifth, but I have all that. I have a bunch of other junk coming up. The pre junk coming up. Okay. Even oh wait, I even had to pay fifteen dollars for my for my prescription toothpaste. Okay. Anyway, all right. Let's just get her done. Okay, you guys. Um, I want you to look at this down here. This is a pile. Can you guys see that pile right there? That is an entire entire pile of handbags because Randy was off yesterday. And when he's off, let me tell you, little ladies, we go crazy. He takes me to like 15,000 different thrift stores. I can't tell you where we were. We were just like all over California yesterday. That's why I didn't make a video because we were sourcing our bootays off. 
Okay, guys, I just, like, I don't know where to start. Um, you know what? I'm actually going to start with this. This is, um, I had this on a haul a couple days ago, and it's a Tory Burch leather wristlet. Okay, so it is genuine leather, uh, gorgeous chocolate brown pebble leather, and uh, yeah, it's, it's an authentic Tory Burch wristlet, and I love it. There's your inside. Am I coming through in the right color okay, you guys? I look really washed out on my end. Does everything look okay on your end? Like, I got the I got the light going on here, trying to give me a little bit more health, healthy look, because I'm feeling like a little not so healthy. <laughs> Anyways, thank you, my girl, Jenny, Jenny, girl, girl. So this is the Tory Burch wristlet, okay? Um, what do I want to show? What do I want to show? What do I want to show? Help me out here, guys. Um, oh, there goes my phone. Oh, I'm just going to show this since it's the newest little, one of the newest little additions. Look at this sweet little um, Betsy Johnson crossbody in gray. Isn't she cute? Cute little crossbody, great little size, silver hardware, little bow with the heart detail. And the inside is fantabulous with gorge. Gorge. Sorry, guys, I was cleaning the purse and I uh, sort of left the napkin in there. Little cell phone carrier, little zipper pocket, and a nice smooth zipper. So this here is Betsy. Johnson, Betsy Johnson, super cute. You know, crossbody. You all know what a crossbody looks like here. Size comparison. Man, oh man. Oh, okay, let's do this one. This one's really cute. I got leather fringe, you guys. I got a leather fringe crossbody. And this is a lot like my Harley Davidson one. Black pebbled leather. A little fringe on it. I guess I probably should stand up and do a size comparison. So this is really cute, can really, really cute bag. There's the back. It's a big crossbody. It's got a zipper top and it has a price in it. Yikes. Okay. Oh, sorry if I scared anybody. Um, it's got the little pocket here. It says genuine leather on the little zipper. Nice smooth zipper, very, very adjustable. Let's see, I probably, I might need to adjust it to show you. Yeah, I'm gonna have to make it longer here for you guys. Actually, I'm not gonna fool with it because I got too many purses to do today. But imagine, it, it definitely can hang lower. Oh, heck with it, Kim. Just do it, quit being lazy. That's why your teeth are falling out. Let's see, no, not really, you guys. That's not why my teeth are falling out. Teeth are falling out because I didn't take time from my damn self. That's why. Oh, okay. Let's see. I'm just adjusting it here for you guys. This is going to be a long video, isn't it? Oh, for goodness sakes. I don't have time to do this adjusting stuff. <laughs> okay. Here it is. Isn't she beautiful? Eee, so cute. So cute. Okay. So... Leather fringe crossbody. Um, let's see. Oh, I'm going to show you this Dooney and Burke over here. This thing is cool. Wait. You know what? I didn't even stuff them yet. I'm just like, you know what? I got to get this. I got to get this freaking video up because I didn't do one yesterday. And all my girls are probably like, Kim's over there just dead or something because I'm here like every day of my life. Look at this navy blue Dooney and Burke with the super pretty leather shoulder strap. There's the Dooney and Burke logo. And this is a, how do you call, what do you call this material? Like a tw canvas tweed or something like that. It's a really, really heavy duty. And then the inside has the little leather cell pocket and a zipper pocket. And then here's the little Dooney and Burt tag with the number 
on it. I wish I would have stuffed these to show you, but you know, you can see, you can see the gorgeousness of it without it being stuffed, right? It's in super great condition. And I love the leather strap on it. And it's really, really lightweight, right, Bug? It's very lightweight, right, my love? Right. Let's aim you down a little so you can see my little girl. Okay. So this is my Dooney and Burke. I'm going to call it canvas and leather, navy blue. All right. Hmm. What else do I want to show? What do I want to show? I don't, you guys, I've got so much, I don't even know. Oh, well, let's do this one. Let's do this one. This one's gorgeous. This is a DKNY smooth leather tote, chain tote. You can wear it with the strap like this or double it for a taupe style. It's in like new condition. It's got a very light sheen. It's a super, super smooth leather. Little twist lock closure. The inside is so pretty. It's got two Safiano slip pockets and also two zipper pockets. Look how pretty that is in like new condition. Hello from Malaysia. Hello, hello. You always, oh, the Netherlands. That is so cool. My husband's family is, for, is Dutch. My hubby is Dutch. Okay, such a pretty red, gorgeous tote bag in a large, medium to large size and is by DKNY, Donna Karen, New York, in case you didn't know the name. Okay, so pretty. Oh, I'm gonna do this one. I'm gonna do this one. This one was thrifted yesterday. <gasps> I wanted to keep it, but I'm like, nope, you cannot. You cannot. Look at the leather on this bad boy. This is by Max New York. Somebody's going to love this. Max New York, gorgeous leather. Look at the buckle detail on the side. It has this nice slip pocket on the back. Ooh, la la, look at this gorgeous piece. Look at the detail on the handles. And it has the pocket, magnetic snap pocket. You can put all your goodies in here. Okay, let's just show you it on. Isn't it gorgeous? I mean, the leather, the leather's a cognac, um, just a really like a raw leather, so pretty. Here it is up close. All right, and then it has the zip top. Look at the zipper pull on this. So it's got, um, let me show you here. It looks like this. It's still got little silica packets in it. Okay, this is a little this is a little pocket right here to put whatever. And this is a leather pocket actually. And then there's the Max New York emblem, the zipper pocket, and then it's got this nice center zip. You can put all kinds of stuff in there. And look at the feet on the bottom, you guys. Look at that. Wowza. Hello, Mission Viejo, California. Beautiful, right? So pretty. Okay, Max New York. Let's see. Oh, oh. Look at this tea and hello, you guys. Oh, you need to grab this so I can get it to you before the... I, did I just break my nail before before the 17th? Because what's the 17th? It's St. Patrick's Day. What do you need on St. Patrick's Day? An adorable green purse, you guys. Look at this suede and leather purse in green suede with green leather trim by Tianello. And okay, let me show you what I want to show you first. Super cute on, so soft. It's got feet on the bottom. And then, oh, I love it. Okay, so the straps are leather, and then here's what the inside looks like. So you have a center 
snap with lots of inner pockets. Okay, then you have a zipper pocket right here. Oh, that's a magnetic snap, by the way. Goes really well. There's a zipper pocket right here. And it's got the zipper pocket right here. If you guys don't buy this, I'm going to keep it and I'm going to use it because this green is so cute. So stinking cute. It's got the adorable little Tianello silver hang tag. Okay. And maybe you're like wearing jeans or something and you just, you want a little, add a little bit of more. When you zip this down, there's like a, like a blue gray color on the inside. So it's got a little color block to it. If you don't want that, just zip it up. But both sides have the option for a little, if you want to match something else, there's a little bit of pop of color. And then a little pop of color. And you can wear it like that. Okay, so this is a green suede and leather Tianello tote. You can fill up with so many goodies. Yes, I'm going to put all kinds of good stuff in here. Cute. This is a fun what's in my purse purse, you know? It's got a lot of neat little pockets. Oh, here's the Tianello sign on the inside. Okay. What else do I want to show here? <laughs> Let's do. You guys ready for this one? Oh, you, I need to cut the strings off of this one. So I'm going to wait on that one. Oh, I'm selling my dumpling purse, you guys. And the reason why is because you saw on my Instagram, I got the leopard one. So since this one was so hard to find and everybody was asking about it and wanting to go look for it, here is mine. I purchased this brand new from Ross and it's by Steve Madden and it's the ever so trendy, trending dumpling cloud bag hinge purse that is in the tricolor, which is uh, like a um, like a tan, a white, and a taupe with a silver chain. You can use it as a crossbody or just use it as a cute little hanging chain as a clutch. It's large, actually. Still has all the tags attached by Steve Madden. Regular price is $69. Open it up. It's nice and large and in charge. Okay. Super, super soft. It's vegan leather. Hi, Paula. So if anybody is wanting this, I'm selling it. Instead of returning it, I will sell it to you guys because I know a lot of you were looking for this bag at your Ross and couldn't find it. This is the one that Lisa Lisa D1 has. That's how I found out about it. I didn't know who she was and somebody mentioned that's who it was. So, okay. There's that. Love the chain on it. Really pretty. Oh, and you can take the chain off if you want. Then I have, what do I want to do? What I want to do? How about this super cute fossil so it's in like a here's the print on it the material it's another like a really thick canvas style by fossil it's got a pocket down here these zippers are awesome they're so thick chunky zippers put all kinds of goodies in there if you like Then you flip the flap and you have a pocket right here. One here. There's, oh boy, there's all kinds of stuff in here. There's one, two, three, four slip pockets, a zipper pocket, and two credit card slots just in this part alone. And then you have like this gigantic main compartment to put all sorts of things in. It's, I would say this is kind of like a West, um, Southwestern sort of print, leather shoulder strap. It's pretty big, 
actually. And you can even attach, I'm sure you ladies have extra crossbody straps. I'm, I'm positive of it. <laughs> Since you have so many bags, um, you can always attach another strap to it, make it a crossbody if you like. So this is my fossil. Oh, yay. I'm so glad you're back to work. School buses. Reads, reads back not to school, but he's playing football. Oh, oh, let me show you this one. I've got them hanging everywhere now. Look at this one, you guys. Okay, this is for my vegan girls or my faux leather. Look at this cutie. Isn't this so cute? I found this one yesterday, too. So wear it as a cute little fringy shoulder bag or it's got the cute chain crossbody on it and it's very adjustable has lots of space for adjusting you can wear it as a crossbody and of course it'll be much cuter filled up when you have your stuff in it love the interior it's a cute little paisley interior with lots of pockets it's got a center zip on it and this one is by this one is by no name but it's a really well made bag here's the center zip and then it's got a sidewall pocket and it's got two slip pockets over here and then it's got a zipper wall pocket right here and it's so fun right i love it so cute oh and it also has a zipper pocket on the back So we're just gonna call this a vegan fringe, brown vegan fringe. It's got all these little rings on it. And if you so wish, you can take some of these fringe off. But I wouldn't, because I just think it's so cute. All right, so there's that. What else do I wanna show? Um, I've got so much stuff, you guys. Oh, this one. I just sold um I just sold my olive green one and now I have purple. Oh yes, look at the sack purple hobo. It's just a full on adorable pebbled leather purple by the sack. Here's the little sack charm. And the zipper pull. Got all the inside pockets in there. Super soft, super lightweight. This front zipper pocket, the bottom. It has the antique brass hardware. Okay. <clears throat> sack is excellent quality. It's really, really good quality. And it's just like so soft and supple. Love this color purple too. It's really, really pretty. Let's see. Um, okay, so I'm going to do some cleaning on this one, but let me show you what I got yesterday. Like I said, I just thrifted everything, got it home. I haven't really done any maintenance on them. I was out all day, but I have this really pretty Michael Kors in a pebble gray silver hardware. Isn't this one pretty, you guys? Like I said, I'm still going to clean it up, sanitize it. Um, here's the interior. Got all the pockets. It's authentic Michael Kors. Center zip. Couple slips on this side. Zip pocket here, little pockets here. There's the Michael Kors tag. And then it's got the top magnetic closure. So that's this way, or you have your shoulder strap. Pretty bag. Okay, so that's my Michael Kors in a gray pebble. It's pretty.
pretty. And silver hardware. Um, oh, this Brighton. Yay, I was so happy to find this Brighton. Hold on, let me get the tag off. I hate when they put sticky tags. It bothers me. Because it takes me forever to get the sticky off after it's purchased. It's going to take me a little... A little minute to get, oh, it's, eh, it's coming off kind of good, I guess. But I have this. You guys, I was just in the real Brighton store in the mall a couple days ago. You know the chocolate brown one that I just sold? And then I also sold the green one in this color. Those bags are still in the Brighton store for 400 bucks. It's just like this one, but this one has, I'll take, I'll get that off. Don't you worry. This is an olive green pebbled leather with the olive green croc embossed um, patent leather with a little fringe. Here's a little pocket. This makes it look terrible. I promise that will not be there when you get it and it'll be all be cleaned up and polished up and you can use it as a crossbody. Brighton is gorgeous. It's got the zipper top. And then <clears throat> the inside is so cute with this key lanyard, leather. And look how cute the inside is with all the pockets, the Brighton Creeds right there. And it's so soft right here. See, I would I would totally keep this one too if it doesn't sell. <laughs> it's got your little heart, the Brighton hang charm. So you can wear it on your shoulder or like I said, you can adjust it to crossbody it. So, so soft and so cute. Does anybody like this one? I definitely like this one. I think it's so cute. Uh, let's see. Am I missing any questions? Could you show the leopard one again? The leopard one? Which, which leopard one? Which leopard one? B, which leopard one? Um... Okay, so yeah, this is my Brighton. Darn it. I hate when I show stuff and I haven't prepared them first, but you guys know I won't ship it like this. Of course not. Um, how many? Okay, how about a Kipling? I have this Kipling here. Gray Kipling. Brand new condition. No, I'm not. I don't have any long chomp today. Brand new condition. Love the interior polka dots. So adorbs, right? Pocket. Zipper pocket. And let's do the pocket on the back. Zipper pocket on the back. Okay, here is the interior with the little key lanyard. Polka dot interior, multiple pockets. There's a little center divider to keep your things separate from each other if you wish to. There's a zipper in here. And this is also an adjustable strap and wear it crossbody if you like. Okay, so that's Kipling. And then, Mm, I don't know, Dee. I'm not sure which, what you're talking about because I have not showed a leopard bag. Did you go through my... Oh, and okay, I already read that. I already read the long chomp. I answered the leopard one. What else do we need, you guys? What are you just dying to see that I probably... I might have. I might, might. Okay, how about this one? Made well. Leather tote. This is super cute. Made well is a very expensive brand, and it's got little perforated little holes in it. And it's got the made well pocket on the inside. It's a raw leather on the inside, very pretty. And 
and this is just a really great boho style bag. What was my most shocking designer score at Lolo Thrift Hermes? That would be my uh, Birkin that I found years and years ago. So cute, right? I like this one. It's really soft. Okay, you guys, I think I think that's good for today. I mean, I got a lot more, but I have I'm gonna make be making tons of videos, so You wish I know how much the purses cost, so I so if I would like to spend the money. Well, you are gonna know as soon as this video is over. You're just gonna click in that description box, and then all the purses will be there, listed for sale. You've been waiting on a hobo Millie Willie wallet, and always miss it when you have one. Oh, I'm sorry, Elaine. Don't give up. I get stuff in all the time. And to tell you the truth, I can't remember what the Millie looks like. Millie. Hmm. I'll have to look that one up. I get lots of Hobo International wallets in. Yeah, they are quiet today, aren't they? There's, can you see Stormy? There's my Stormy over there. Nope, you can't see him. It's a mess over there. Yeah, he's, he's here. Oh, you want me to show you a Hobo I, I actually thrifted yesterday too? Look at this mess, you guys. This is a total mess. Excuse my booty. Don't look at my booty. Here's a hobo that I thrifted, Hobo International, and I got, I didn't get this off of uh, my Facebook marketplace. I got this at the thrift store, actually. It's a really pretty chocolate brown with silver hardware, snaps at the top, and it's still new with tags, and it's so cute because you can use it as a wallet, obviously, or you can bring the little chains out and use it as like a little like just to take into the store, whatnot. Which is the name of this one? This is the Mogano. Mogano. M O G. Hayward. Hayward? Isn't that so cute? And then the inside. This one is a discontinued style. So here's all the little chains. And then you have all your credit card slots over here. You have this pocket. And then a zipper pocket for your coin. Nice and roomy. You can fit your cell phone in there. I don't have my cell phone to show you. But isn't that adorable? And all the tags are still attached. And it's so cute. Any pink and black Betsy Johnson? Why, yes, I do. Finally have something somebody's asking for. Here is my pink and black Betsy Johnson. So it's black and white stripe on the front, baby pink quilted on the side. Black and white. It's got the cute little top handle or a crossbody shoulder strap and a little black poof. And it's in like new condition. Okay, and then the inside looks like, let me show you the top, what the top looks like. <laughs> it's yours. <laughs> I know, it's cute, right? Look at the inside. If you like the outside, you're gonna love the inside. Look at the inside. Little, little, rosebuds and roses baby rose and rosebuds and there's two slip pockets on this wall and then you have a zipper pocket maybe you want to put um your wallet and things like that in here so you also have a zipper pocket that says Betsy johnson right here and that's just quit you're looking honey what you're looking Okay, and it is a light gold hardware. Oh, here's the bottom. So this is this is the only pink and black Betsy that I have right now. Okay. 
Um, yeah, almost, almost all of it. All of, a lot of my, well, half and half. Half thrifted, half not thrifted. Okay, Joey, no problem at all. Give me about 15 minutes, 10 to 15 minutes to get these items listed. And, um, it'll all be up and ready to go. So I'm going to go ahead and go, you guys. So I think I've got a lot of bags here I need to list. So uh, feel free to donate to my, <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. I'm not asking for donations. I'm kidding, kidding, kidding. If you guys don't know what I'm talking about, I just talked about major dental work I have to get done. So um, yeah, need to replenish the account. So whatever comes in is going right back into Reed's college money. That's what I'm doing. So Oh, that's awesome, Mystical. All right, you guys, I will see you on tomorrow's video because we're going to do another sales video probably, I'm thinking. It's either going to be thrifting or sales. I'm not sure yet. All depends on what we got going on for tomorrow. Um, I can actually, what time is it right now? It's 12. I will try to get today's purchases out in the mail when the mailman comes. The mailman comes at 2, my time. So, and it's 12 right now. So that's two hours I have to get your guys' orders in, packaged up and shipped out and then get them to you as soon as we can. All right, you guys? Okay, so stay humble. I, Helena, you know, I never know what time it's going on because it depends on my work, depends on my schedule, life. That's why it's just like life, whatever. I try to get up as early as I can to get this on, but we shall see, okay, you guys? All right, you guys, thank you so much for joining us here. We love you and um, take care of yourself. Get your get your asses to the dentist and to the doctors. Don't do what I did, okay? Don't do it. Don't do it. Don't do it. All right, you guys, love you. Stay humble, stay kind, and I'll see you tomorrow. Bye, my friends.